Hey, hey everyone. Looks like we have a new software update. Had my vehicle parked in the garage for uh, the night because I'm not planning on going anywhere and happened to look at my phone and saw that there was a software update. So let's see what this update is going to be. Or actually, let's not see what it's going to be because it won't know until it's done. Uh, software. Software update. Th and this is software update 2022.28.1. Um, like I've said before with the last update video, I will go online like to YouTube and see if anyone has already posted on what um, this update is so I can see if it's just gonna be bug fixes or if it's gonna be something cool um, I had, didn't find anything yet so I'm gonna go ahead and just post this one and, and um, say what it is so let's go ahead and get it started uh, we want to install now so like always if you guys know anything about these updates it gives you this little countdown so we're not going to say or I'm not going to bore you with all this so we're going to let it do its countdown and start the update and then I'll be back and we'll find out what it is together so see you back in just a little bit all right let's see what we've got with this new update let's see let's go to release notes so there's this status bar uh, miscellaneous improvements uh, status bar with select a status bar with select quick control has been added to the top of the touchscreen map um, and this is software update 2022.28.1 uh, we'll have to see what that means I don't know what that means uh, theater mode full screen theater mode can now be minimal, minimalized allowing access to vehicle controls without video playback interruption tap to tap the minimize button on the top left corner of the window to toggle full screen mode so let's see what that is. status bar let's go to controls software because uh, that status bar I'm not really I don't know what that is Uh, release notes. Uh, alternate route navigate navigation improvements. So, I don't know. I guess it wasn't. I guess that's part of it. But anyway, so it says view up the three routes when navigating to a destination quickly compare the total travel time and traffic information for each route note traffic information is only displayed with premium connectivity um, which I have premium connectivity in this and this is what I think it is I will totally lock this um, because sometimes when I'm navigating somewhere, I'm just kind of wondering if the navigation is actually taking me like the best route. Because uh, sometimes I'll put an address in navigation, and once I'm started going there, I realize that there was a totally different way I could have went that would have probably been a little more convenient for me, or just been on a route that I am more familiar with than the one that the navigation is taking. So, um, I like that this will give you 
to options of different ways to take and you can pick which one that you would rather take so that seems cool so status bar so status bar uh, a status bar with select quick controls has been added I'm not really sure what that is I'm sure this is gonna be something new at the top of the screen um, which I think was already there I don't know it's obviously something that I haven't missed so it's probably something I'm not going to use uh, theater mode this I do think is cool so what it is is when you are you know typically let's just give it a try and get out of that so we'll go to theater Netflix so it takes up the whole screen oh yeah up here in the corner see the new little well it was there now it's went away oh see the little thing so you can tap that and it minimizes that so you can still see stuff on this side of the screen um, and controls So yeah, it you can do full screen or you know minimize it. Um, and something I need to work on because I haven't quite figured out how you can move. Like if I want this over on this side of the screen, I thought, oh there we go. See, I have done that before and nothing worked. <laughs> it didn't do that. So yeah. So I like that where you can still watch Netflix or YouTube or whatever the case may be and still have stuff over here uh, so yeah I like that part and then just hit that again to make it full screen so yeah I like that so that other that he was talking about status bar I don't it has that up there which is you know always been there but yeah <clears throat> anyway so yeah that is what is new with the update uh, 2022.28.1 and I like that navigation thing that lets you pick different uh, directions to go instead of just relying on the one that the navigation is giving you and guys I picked this up in June. It is now September. You see those miles? Just over 6,900 miles already on this. I've been driving this thing a lot. I love this car. Uh, so that's why I drive it a lot. Um, but I am curious about this new Mercedes EQS SUV that is coming out really curious about that because uh, as everyone knows the build quality in a Tesla isn't the greatest and which should be by now since Tesla has been around for a while and I have driven Mercedes for years up until I got my first Tesla I've had Mercedes for years build quality is so much better in those so um that new Mercedes EQS SUV when it comes out I may be giving that a look at and see what I think about it in person I like the way it looks um, in video or whatnot but um, yeah I want to see it in person but that's it for now <clears throat> I got my little buddy out here with me my little dog Soot I don't know if you can see him too well because come here come here there he is. There's Soot. Can't really see him too well. He's black and he kind of blends in. <laughs> he come out here to do the video with me. Anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching this video. I know the quality is terrible. Um, I'm still uh, working on getting a new phone. My um, 
12 year old is going to be getting this phone and we keep telling him he's not getting a phone until he turns 13 uh, and he's going to get this old phone and so I've been trying to hold off till he turns 13 to, to get a new phone and then give him this one but I may have to just break down and go ahead and get another phone and then just go ahead and give him this one because the quality is terrible it's cracked and it's only cracked in the front so I don't know why the camera part of it's so bad anyway but uh, back to my channel I really do appreciate everyone that is subscribing to my channel everyone that has commented on my videos um, my videos are getting quite a few views uh, but I only have like 27 subscribers so please guys if you are watching my videos even if they are random and boring and me just rambling on um, and you may or may not want to watch another one of my videos if you could just still uh, hit that subscribe button I'm really trying to build my channel and it also encourages me to make more videos um, and hopefully the quality will be better soon when I get another phone but uh, anyway just uh, please subscribe and again I do appreciate uh, you guys watching thanks so much till next video